Life gets busy, work beckons, it's an unfortunate reality of life that means we have to leave our dogs at home. But a 13 year old right here in West Michigan has come up with a solution. Off we went, bought a bus. And here we are. This bus is not your typical fare. It's certainly not picking up gaggles of third graders. Pretty empty, so we could just make it how we wanted. No, Amy Ostveen and her 13 year old son, Alexander Slot, bought this bus to shuttle around dogs. About two years ago, Alexander started walking dogs just locally around our neighborhood. In November of last year, mom found a video online of a somewhat similar operation happening in Alaska. I was like, if you could start a business, what would you want to do? And he's like, I just want to be with dogs. So by December, mom and son were launching Wagging Riders. This is what we created. He came up with a name on his own. He's doing a ton of the work on his own. He invested in the bus on his own. Here's the premise. Running Monday through Thursday, the pair trek out near their home in Byron Center, along with younger sister Nevada, as both kids are homeschooled. I calm the dogs down, and I sing a lullaby to them. Picking up people's dogs, loading them up into their custom-built space. We made a little a U-shaped bench, and we put bars on there so that each dog we could hook up onto a leash and they can just lay down right on the bench and they can be by their best friends. Making sure each one is safely strapped in. And then you hook them right up to here and then you give them a treat and then they'll just lay down and you give them a little bit of pets and then we go to the next dog. I think we've gotten a lot quicker. <laughs> and then we're going to go to the dog park. It really is an adventure. Week one, none of the dogs knew each other, but now we have assigned seating on the bus. A chance for your dog to socialize and get out all of that extra energy at the park. For the moment, they can handle 14 dogs max on board. A spot on the bus costs $25 each day. There's been a lot of things that didn't go like necessarily as planned, but um, we've made memories along the way. There's going to be ups and downs, but you just really got to stick with it, and then your dreams will come true. We have information up now on our website. If you're interested in booking some of these adventures for your dog, Alexander says in the future he's considering possibly franchising the idea out to other states. He says he's excited to see where his first business will take him. For now, in Byron Center, Michael Martin, Fox 17 News.